and welcome to my video. Today I want to show you how to clean the catchy fly trap. That's actually the best fly trap I've ever had but unfortunately like you can see um, it gets really dirty over time and um, it's really difficult to clean because you can't take the top off. It's all one piece. Um, you can open the bottom obviously to um, like you can see to remove the sticky part um, where all the, the fruit flies and insects um, a sticking to um, but other than that you can't take apart any of the top part that's like really dusty like you can see in the picture here um, so I really try to find methods how to clean it and the easiest way even though it takes a while is with using two um, even more q-tips um, and you kind of have to just go from the top um, and go through the little lines with um, a q-tip and try to um, get the dust out of um, the in-between spaces but that work, works actually pretty good um, because the dust is sticking to the q-tips like you can see here in the picture um, and that's the easiest way to get all the dust out of there um, and have a, a really nice and clean catchy fly trap afterwards. Um, I also just wipe it off with a wet paper towel um, to get the dust off that's just like sitting on the surface. Um, just like wipe it off all around and then also um, on the bottom when you like here can you, you can see that um, it looks already much much better. From the top you almost don't see any dust anymore so all the fruit flies they can like go through. That was one issue that they like didn't go through anymore because it was all um, clogged with the dust. But yeah, the, the bottom part I would recommend to clean it too. Just open it um, and then go with a wet paper towel um, all around and wipe it off. And also maybe if you have another q-tip, just go through the little lines there um, and um, try to get the last dust out. Um, and at the end, um, just turn it um, upside down and shake it a little bit so the the dust that you just like try to wipe out the rest of it just falls out like you can see here and then wipe around one more time and then that's pretty much it then you have a really really clean catchy fly trap again thanks for watching